When I was a kid, I hardly thought about my heart and lungs. Like so many of us, I took them for granted. But as a cystic fibrosis sufferer, I soon realised just how precious these vital organs can be. For one in six Australians with cardiovascular disease, a simple heartbeat can never be taken for granted. For one in 10 of us with lung disease, a single breath of air will always be so precious. That's why St Vincent's Hospital Sydney is committed to keeping hearts beating and lungs breathing. And that's why in 2014, they launched the St Vincent's Heart Lung Innovation Fund to continue to support groundbreaking technologies that help our families and friends live long and healthy lives. St Vincent's legacy of world first heart and lung procedures began in 1984. It's this legacy that inspires them to continue being pioneers. Like the first time a heart that stopped beating was brought back to life and used for an organ transplant. The first time a pair of lungs was resuscitated and transplanted successfully. The first time a leaking heart valve was replaced in a still beating heart. And the first time in Australia that a miniature heart assistance device was implanted to help a heart continue pumping. I am one of the lucky ones. Because of St Vincent's, I was fortunate enough to undergo a double lung transplant that gave me a second chance of life. But to keep saving lives of people with heart and lung disease, they need your help. With your support, St Vincent's will continue to pioneer procedures that save damaged lungs and mend broken hearts. So please, help people like me and donate to the St Vincent's Heart Lung Innovation Fund today. With your support, we can keep our family and friends alive.